The first thing we will do will be to lay this, the framing square as shown in the video. And you can use the front or the back of the framing square to help you if you're lining up the tread. You can use the 11 inch, we're laying out 11 inch um, treads. You can use the front of the framing square or the back. I like to use the back of the framing square and line it up with the next riser. And make sure that the framing square is lined up with the stair tread. This is important before you mark the first riser. So uh, framing square lined up and positioned correctly. And then you will measure for the distance of the bottom step. And this one here is going to be six and three quarter inches. Um, I like to hold the tape measure, use the tape measure. Since we're using seven and a half inch risers, I like to position the tape measure at seven and a half inches and then mark the three quarter inch line at the bottom of the tape measure. Uh, you just simply mark whatever you are subtracting your tread thickness for to get the bottom line. Next up, place the framing square. Position it correctly. Make sure that you line it up with, it, with your marks. And then once you have it positioned, mark it. Next thing you're going to need to do is double check these measurements. Double check everything all the time. And uh, this can be done as shown here. Line up the uh, seven and a half inches and make sure that uh, the three quarter inch mark at the bottom is working out okay. And you're done.